More police in the skies. Well, it's the focus of a town hall meeting being held tonight at Bethesda Chevy Chase High School. All right, let's get Stephanie Ramirez in Bethesda with more for us. Good, uh, good morning. Hi, good morning, guys. And this is about Montgomery County Police expanding their drone program. Right now, they have a pilot program operating in Silver Spring and in Wheaton. It's called DFR, the Drone as a First Responder Program, meant to help police get real-time information on incidents. And this morning, we got a chance to chat one-on-one -on -one with the 3rd District Commander on how this would operate in Bethesda and Chevy Chase. For example, we asked about something covered last year, police responding to large groups of teens fighting. Captain Jason Coquinos also heads the department's special operations division. The the drone is first responder program. It there's a drone that's pre-positioned on a rooftop and this will be in downtown Bethesda. And that drone will be sent to 911 or police generated calls. So if someone calls 911 and says, you know, there's a bunch of kids fighting at the metro, or that would be an assault in progress, we would send the drone to that. If an officer sees something, um, you know, an officer can can call out with that. The drone can go assist the officer. So that's one call type that we would fly for. So, uh, but one thing that the drone as first responder does not do is proactively patrol. So you won't see a drone flying around Bethesda patrolling. You're not going to see a drone surveilling anything like that. So it would be in response to a call. The other cool piece is the drone gets there so fast that in um, over 140 calls, we've actually been able to cancel police officers. So we have officers that are on the way. The drone gets there first, de determines that an officer is not needed, and that helps with our staffing shortages. So we're allowed to free up officers to go to other emergencies. So it's been pretty successful so far. And in that second part there, the commander's talking about how it's been operating in Silver Spring and in Wheaton under the pilot program that's been going since November. And he says so far they've been able to recover about 200 people with the help of a drone. Uh, he's also saying that the drones are getting to the scene within a minute or less, but he emphasized there it won't be pre-monitoring or patrolling. So something after a Friday Night Lights football game or during a protest or something like that, you, you won't see it. He says an emergency has to trigger it. We'll include more of the conversation online on fox5dc.com. Tonight's town hall meeting with the Bethesda Chevy Chase community happens at 7 o'clock at BCC High School. I'll send it back to you. All right.